welcome back. As you know, we are learning objects in JavaScript. In the last lecture, we learned about prototypes. In this session, we are going to learn date object in JavaScript. But first, let us start with the agenda. We will start with the example of date object and see the format with which we can get any date. After that, list of get methods and important examples. Then a list of set methods and important examples. And at the end, there is an assignment for you. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started. JavaScript has a default object called date object. It allows us to work with dates. Let us see how we can do that. We just date object today and displayed it. It returned today's date and time. Type of date is object. Sometimes you want another date and time, so we can do that as well. You can write the date also like this. JavaScript allows us to use some method which helps us get the information about date and time. The table contains some get methods of date objects. Method description. Get full year. Get the year as a four digit number. Y, 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 Y. Get month. Get the month as a number 0 to 11. Get date. Get the day as a number 1 to 31. Get hours. Get the hour 0 to 23. Get minutes. Get the minute 0 to 59. Get seconds. Get the second 0 to 59. Get milliseconds. Get the millisecond 0 to 999. Get time. Get the time milliseconds since January 1, 1970. Get day. Get the weekday as a number 0 to 6. Date dot now. Get the time dot ECMA script 5. So these are the few get methods. Let us see how we can implement them in the program. So we are going to apply the methods on this date. It returns the minutes from the day. It returns the hours from the day. It returns the timestamp of milliseconds since January 1, 1970. Get month counts the day from January and it counts from zero. So these are the get methods in the date object. There are some set methods also. Set date methods are used for setting a part of a date. The table shows the method and how we can use them. Method description. Set date. Set the day as a number 1 to 31. Set full year. Set the year optionally month and day. Set hours, set the hour 0 to 23. Set milliseconds, set the milliseconds 0 to 999. Set minutes, set the minutes 0 to 59. Set month, set the month 0 to 11. Set seconds, set the seconds 0 to 59. Set time, set the time milliseconds since January 1, 1970. Now let us see the example. First, let's get a date. We are going to apply the methods on this date. We can set the date with this method. We change the date from Thursday, August 4 to Saturday, August 23rd. The day automatically gets changed. The set month method counts the months from zero. So, zero stands for January. The day automatically gets changed here as well. We can change the whole year with the help of this method. We changed it to 1900. The day also gets changed. We can set minutes with this method. We set it to 2. Just like minutes, we can set hours also. Here we changed it to 1. Set seconds method allows us to set seconds. Here we set it to 0, 3 seconds. So these methods are really easy to understand and implement, aren't they? Well, I hope you got a clear idea and understanding of date object and how we should be using them. So solve this assignment. Get today's date and set a new date and year to it. Okay then, we will meet very soon in the next lecture with a map object. Till then, bye. Oh, 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 oh,